I mean, it started very well. I had a, made a very long putt on one. I mean, it was a very good putt, but unexpected when you make such a long one. And on two, I put it to one foot. So those were two very starting easy birdies, and that sent the, set the momentum in a way. Um, then I parted all the way to the last two again, and I made birdie on the last two par fives. So that was a huge, you know, boost, and it's just, it just came flowing. It was, it was very good. Um, and then the back nine, I think I had a birdie straight away on 10 again, and maybe that's what set the momentum, because sometimes when you make a turn, you hit the brakes a bit, and you just don't even realize you're doing it, but the birdie on the, on the 10th hole really helped. And then I don't remember where I made the other ones, then birdie on 18, and, but, yeah, it was pretty good. I, bird, I think I birdied all the par fives, so that really helps. It's always good to finish strong, especially after um, a bogey on 17. It sounds silly, but you try go bogey free, and when you have that one bogey, you feel like it's like a stain on your shirt. You're like, oh no, that's, you know, it's a pity. But I was very happy I made that that birdie on 18, and it's mainly not for the game, but it's just for the mental uh, boost of knowing that you know I can do it. I know that even if I know that it's a good score, I, I'm able to post low numbers, and even after a bogey, I managed to to make a, I make a good birdie. Uh, no, I mean, you don't expect it. I came in playing well. Um, I'm still working on some things on my swing, and today they worked out very well. You never expect a seven under, but when it comes, you just you know take it happily and, and move on. But it's, tomorrow's just another day. Um, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Uh, well, I flew from Hawaii to San Francisco on a red eye on Saturday. Played a practice round Sunday when I landed then played the Monday qualifier on Monday and left Tuesday. And the travel was actually pretty hard. It took 16 hours to get here with two delays and one canceled flight. So drove here on Wednesday morning and teed it up on the Param at 1. And I, that was my practice round. And then went yesterday, just had an easy practice day in the morning and went to relax, just, you know, get my sleep back and get ready for today. And it worked out just fine. Well, as most people know, I grew up in Kenya. So... Growing up there, you know, it's a huge blessing and I'm very, very lucky and I can't wait to go back every year in December and growing up there I have a huge love for animals and um, that obviously is a huge part of my heart and this, this last December I went on a big safari with my dad and I saw how tourism is affecting, you know, poaching in Africa. The, least, the less tourists come, the more the poaching increases. So this year I decided to support a non-profit and it's called Big Life, and it's um, all the money goes to helping animals and protect animals in, uh, in Africa and some part of Tanzania.